Hello and welcome back to the next episode of the Pokemon Gold Randomized Stars Lock. In today's episode, we are making our way through Union Cave, onwards to Azalea City, where the next gym lies. Um, we should be putting up with our new boy Stank at the front. We still only have really 14 members. Um, oh, he's down there. Okay, that's better for me, because now I can... I don't want to have Stank at the front, because uh, Stank is the lowest level, but... The good news is, there we go. We can swap him in for battles if I know where the battles are. Which I roughly do, but whatever. He's got three Pokemon. What you got? Sand Slash? I mean, we just fought a level seven to seven and nine gym leader, so having a level four on a wild trainer is actually kind of hilarious. Imagine going to Mount Moon, they had level fours. You'd just be like, what is going on? <laughs> there we go. A Wedley. We got a swap for Weedle because he four times resists grass, so uh Tomb Sock can get some free XP, why not? One. One boy. Like it's just not worth the time trying to actually hit a Weedle. Mabba Weedle. No poison point for you, there are no abilities. Where are you going next, sir? A Sora Bulba. What is your level? He's a level 8 Bulbasaur, okay. What can Stank... Stank can't do anything though. What can do is absorb, which again he four times resists. Let's go back into Tube Sock. We're gonna hit the Thrash. We're going to thrash the shit out of this Bulbasaur right now, come on. The leftover just annihilates. Anything he, anything he does, the leftover's just like... Mm. Big on. Yeah, he's staying in level. Stank's luckier coming into play. Right, I'm going to do Stank up front because he's a bit slow, but there is the Fire Breather right here. Who hates Zubats, by the way. <laughs> Zubats keep confusing my Pokemon. I'm seriously upset about it. <laughs> yep, I don't know how you feel, my brother, but at least in this game they evolve into Crobat, so um, actually very good. Oh, what Let me mute that for a second. I swear to God, as soon as I start recording, I just feel sick. <laughs> and it's not my room, because I'm normally sitting here, like, watching YouTube and such. And I'm not sneezing, I'm not coughing, my throat isn't itching. None of that nonsense. And as soon as I start recording, I'm like, <laughs> my nose is blocked. I don't know why I'm allergic to recording YouTube. That's why I keep taking two weeks off. <laughs> um... Yeah, it's just a Rattata. Not much to speak about there. But he has... Wow, Buffett. The Nuzlocke Killer. Fun fact. Warbuffet is not as much of a Nuzlocke Killer in this game. The reason Warbuffet is not as much of a Nuzlocke Killer in this game is because why he has the same moveset... Mm -mm 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 he has still got Counter, he still has got Miracle. Um, he's still got um, Safeguard. You keep doing that, bro. I'm just going to do this so it lowers your uh, evasion. Just as more likely that I'm going to hit my move when I wanted to kill your punching bag self. This is where having growth on. <laughs> I don't want to lose any of these boys, to be honest. <laughs> Look, do you see how this game cheats? It knows, like, it knew I was swapping to a physical attacker and then went for counter. Not just a defense call. Watch his counter again. The game cheats. Now, this thing has a lot of HP. So I'm just gonna let the poison do its thing. If you have a dark type though, these things are a joke. You just buy them and they die. I think that's more than enough, so let's just thrash him. That should TKO, thank you, sir. But you may notice the fact that I can swap out. Yes, you can swap out, because it doesn't have the ability Shadow Tag, because there's no abilities in this game. That's not to the next game. So for this game, Mobafet is not as much of a threat, because you can always swap. Great balls. Why, thank you, sir. I do have a pair of great balls. Actually, I think I've got one great ball at the moment. But this gives me 
Okay. Speed up to the bottom. I'm gonna give him Mystic Water, that's very nice. Smoky, you gained a 20% power to all your water moves, thank you. Do do do. Do do do. Fight me, sir. That's not the clown music, it's just. Is that the start to, um. Oh, what's that level in Sonic 3? The, the weird carnival zone. It's not. Is it Carnival Night Zone? <clears throat> it's like you're about to go there. And also, sorry, Meryl, you're about to be absorbed for your delicious nutrients to feed my stank's growth. I'm growing my stank. Oh no! Yeah, without huge power, Meryl is. A, oh, and fairy typing. Meryl is a pushover. It's like level 18, it becomes an Azumarill, and it just has terrible stats. But I don't get. I don't actually honestly understand the point of Meryl. I don't. I don't get it. Ow. I don't understand. Anyway, there we go. Gymnastic. <laughs> Gymnast Larry is gone. Good. Ah, I want the titar, brother. Oi, 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 bloody titar. Sado legendary Tyranitar. Look at this thing. He just went. Hmm. He just went. Hmm. I see your super effective absorb, even though you're double my level, and I don't care. <laughs> I'm only gonna take half my health. Ah. What fifteen though? Where are you sleep powder? Anyway, we're coming up here because there's items up here. Oh look, it's Cordyceps. Parasect. I wonder how long it took people to realize that the power in Paris and Parasect stands for Parasite because it's got a parasitic mushroom growing on it. Ooh, hit on top. Look how pink hit on top is. They didn't really do the brown properly, so it's kind of like pink on top. It's like a pinky brown. Team's ready. Which is, because these are randomized as well. <coughs> slash. Oh. Unlike Thrash, I will hold on to Slash, because Slash is actually very good. And what? Yes, sir. I should add, by the way, because I believe I forgot to add this in the rules section, because it wasn't in the last game. In this game, there are shinies. Shinies have been added in this game. They have a different color palette, and they make a little jingle jangle with Shamu Shine whenever they come out. Uh, there's Gyarados. If the Gyarados was red, I'd love to have a Gyarados. If the Gyarados was red, then it would be a shiny Gyarados. And they would do the Shimmery Shine. We're guaranteed one uh, later in the game. Thanks for the free Pokeball. Um, we're guaranteed one later on, but if we do find one in the wild, uh, we are allowed to catch it as it counts as it's such a rare occasion to find a shiny. Um, it's like one in 4,096 chance of the Pokemon you encounter being shiny, and that doesn't, like, that resets every encounter. So it's just one in 4,000 chance every encounter for it to be a shiny. Like, he would be kind of turquoise. Wish I had a Blastoise. Actually, I'm not going to have a Blastoise. I'm not going to bother absorbing you, my bro. Because <coughs> as good as you are, you're just not that good. Okay. I mean, they talk about lights in the cave, but it's not dark. Like, there's no flashing in this cave at all. <clears throat> so, I don't know what he's, like, getting on about, but Ray wants a battle. So, what's Ray got? Octillery with yellow eyes, because they couldn't be bothered to make the eyes white, even though that is a part of the color palette, to make anything on the, can be white or black. They're just the three colors. No. Super effective. No more going to do shit to me, bro. Once I get to 16, I'm going to swap out for the, uh, the Miracle Seed. Because look how much damage we're doing already. That's just a shitty absorb. Almost. <laughs> Almost. There isn't going to be a new encounter outside, so... Um... <sighs> You're going to be annoying to kill, though. Can I have like, can I have like the um... 
You know what? No. The Smoochum's in the cave. I mean, I believe I can defeat a Smoochum relatively easy. I just want that little bit of XP just to... You know. Just to level up. That's all I'm trying to do. Please, sir, let me level up. There we go. Hey, can I get sleep powder or something, please? Sunsport? Okay, Sunsport's fair enough. I had a feeling that I was going to get a move at 16, so I was like, please. We're not going to get this thing, because uh, it's a waste of time. This guy is an encounter, but what we want to do first is we are now on Route 33. Which I believe... Is that the same or different? So yeah, that was Route 32. So yeah, this is Route 33, which is... Where the tourists... Yep, this is it's this one piece of grass here. This one piece of grass here is uh, a new route. So let's see what this is. What do we get? So my ears a bit itchy. The trio 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 that are made out of clay. No, my attack stat, please. I mean, of course it didn't affect them. These are again going to be a... Can you hit once, you fucking blind-ass flower? Gee, why does it always take three hits to actually land a, land a powder or a spore with this thing? Right, they're paralyzed. They're level six. We've got 36 Pokeballs. I don't want to hit them. Dodge has paper-thin HP and defenses. Ugh, of course they just break out like it's fucking nothing. <laughs> Oh, oh, magnitude nine. That's gonna do a shit ton of damage. <laughs> um, they're weak to water. They are weak to grass. I can't hit them with electricity. They're immune to it. What am I supposed to do? All right, I got an idea. I've got an idea. Tube sock come out. I need them. And you notice they've not been fully paralyzed either. They've not been fully paralyzed once. Not once. I am going to defense curl. And hope they ground me a few times. Magnitude's fine, bro. That's five damage and I recover three of it. So they keep defense curling. And you missed the... I ain't even lowered their... I ain't even lowered nothing. Why are they missing growl? Just growl me, bro. Thank you. I want them to growl me a few times and then I'm gonna... Quick attack. That's two. One more, please. You know what? Fuck it. <laughs> I ain't got time to waste. All right, that's good. 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 I want them to grab me one more time, by the way. But in the meantime, to waste time, I'm going to throw Pokeballs because they're now under half and they're paralyzed. Why even bother, bro? Oh, finally, you're fully paralyzed. Oh, finally, you're fully paralyzed. You realize you have paralysis. <sighs> I don't get the ball calculations in this game, man, honestly. And this was route 33. And you may have saw ahead we have um, a forest and a well to go to. We have Doug Trio, the mole. Its three heads bob separately up and down to loosen the soil nearby, making it easier for it to burrow. Yep. Bop it. Now this gentleman here is a bad man. And he said he's exhausted from traveling through the cave and wants to battle us as a refresher. Which sounds absolutely idiotic to me, but anyway. Of course you're in the north. 
Bug poison, huh? You know what? Tube sock. Come to me. Having Doug Cho, though, is not that bad because um, he's on the team for now, as you may see. Down there. Um, we don't have a ground type. That's type we don't have. If we don't have him, we can get on the team. And just like no damage, just thrashing and taking no damage. Uh, what else you got? Houndoom? Mm hmm. Again, something we can't really deal with, but um, with our uh, plant. But we can deal with this guy. And plus, once we get Dutch up, Dutch going to be super fast and magnitude does tons of damage. He lived a, he lived a mystic water water gun from Smokey. Damn. That is a thick houndoom. That thing just took it like a champion. Mm. Look at that XP. Look at that delicious experience points. Uh, I want to check something real quick. You're 16 though, so I'm going to take your lucky egg. And at the bottom, you're going to have the miracle seed. And I'm going to swap you with that, and then switch you to the front, because you are now the proud owner of a lucky egg. So we can get you up to level very quickly. Up it. Now he is paralyzed, but me. Oh no, it appears to be. It's as if to go in there, so I'm standing guard. I am entire good Samaritan. Mm, that black uniform looks very familiar. Anyway, if we head up in here, is there anything new? Mm, charcoal for 9,000. We can buy super potions. And we can buy repels. How many can we buy? We can buy it's by 5, no need to buy 6. We got anything to sell? Probably do. Max Ether, we don't want to sell. Max Speed, don't care. Oh, sorry, X Speed, not Max Speed. X Defense, don't care, sell that. Alright, that's fine. Alright, we all good. We all good. Don't worry about nothing. Alright, we're going to Pokemon Center and heal up here. Heal that. Yeah, 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 yeah. Did I heal or did I just mash it wrong? No, oh, I healed. Right. Now, we can't go into the gym, because as you may notice, in front of the gym is a gentleman who's also in the strange black uniform that's kind of familiar. Do you know about Slowpoke Tails? I heard it's tasty. Aren't you glad I told you that? Not really. Now, if you go this way, nothing happens. Bear this in mind. However, if you come out here, we are now in Ilex Forest. And I do actually want to swap to Stank. And then use Sweet Scent, so I don't really want to run around in here. And we can get our encounter for Alex Forest early. Oh, I love Mareep. It's a duplicate typing, but it's cool. Yeah. Absorb should not kill, I swear to God. That was very close. I can't wait to get Great Balls though. I think we get Great Balls in Goldenrod. So we bought 40 Poke Balls and we've just been chucking them at shit and they've just been breaking out casually. Anyway, we've got a Reap, yay! I'll write this down real quick. So we've got Mareep. Ilex Forest. Never remember if it's one or two hours in forest because I'm stupid. Um, we have Mareep. Wool. Just wool, as you do. Aesthetic electricity builds up in its body. Its fleece doubles in volume. Touching it will shock you. Um, yep. Yeah. Um, Mareep is a male. Alexander. I thought you Alexander. I just put Alexandria because it's the like, house of Alexandria, right? The, the ancient city of Alexandria with the lost scrolls and whatnot. 
burnt down and all that kind of stuff. Anyway, if we go in here, we go to cut angle. Mm, who are you? Golda, you want me to make you some Pokeballs? Sorry, I have to wait. Do you know about Team Rocket? Uh, don't worry, I'll tell you right how. Team Rocket is an evil gang who uses Pokemon for the dirty work. They are supposed to be disbanded three years ago. Anyway, I read the well. Cutting off Slowpoke test for sale, so I'm going to give them a lesson in pain. Hang on, Slowpoke, old Kurt Angle's eyes way. <laughs> he give you the three eyes. <coughs> Jesus. Anyway, I'm going to heal real quick. <laughs> I said real quick, I meant real quick. So let's head into the poke slow ball. So again, we're going to follow the same strategy. Before we even ask old Kurt about Wagwan, uh, sweet send, please. Let's go and count them. So our encounter for here is Sudubudu. And if someone does any woodoo, it's Sudubudu. Anyway, same thing, let's unspore him. Sudo is going to be a pain in the ass to catch as well, because I think he has a decent, decently high catch rate. Uh, we can go into on brother here, Tube Sock. He is a rock type. As you can tell, he's throwing rock stars, so he does resist what we can do to him. And what we can do to him is quick as out. That's fine. Okay, he's doing like five damage and we're healing three bats. So he's doing like two damage of Rock Throw. Gloss Rock Throw has shit accuracy, so um, he just learned quick attack, I guess. Thanks for the free heal, bro. We're gonna find a Pokeball because he is paralyzed and yellow. I doubt it's gonna catch, but let's try. Sorry, another one. Was that a fluke or was it was teasing me or is that actual um Two in a row roll three? I mean he doesn't have a if he had a ground or something, I probably could quick attack him one more time. I hate this game sometimes. Alright, we're gonna have to do a quick attack. If he don't live it, I don't care no more. <laughs> Just to be honest. Alright, he lived it. I thought he was gonna live it, but I was like, if it, if it crits, he dies. That's all. We really do need to start stacking up encounters. I don't know what's in the egg. It could be trash. There could be garbage in the egg. And we got another slot. I mean, putting a rock type on the team with a ground type is like meh. We really could use a flying or a fire type, to be honest. But yeah, we got a pseudo we do. Sudo, Woodo. Um, and it's slow poke. Well, okay. well, well, well. What do we have here then? Sudo Woodo imitation. Although it always pretends to be a tree, its compassion oh, wait, appears to be closer. Composition appears to be closer to a rock than a plant. I mean, it's a rock type, so yeah. I'm gonna give you a funny name. I already thought of one. You've got a friend in me. It's Woody. So now we got that out of the way. Hey there, Gold. The cards took off when I shouted at them, but then I took a tumble down the well, so I slammed it hard on my back and I can't move. Huh, rats. If I were fit, my Pokemon would punch them. Totally. Uh, no, I guess it can't be helped. <laughs> Gold showed them how gutsy you are in my place. I'm totally not lying here. I'm, uh, I'm not being a dick. Uh, let's see. Now we no longer need you at the front. It's time to get to bop it some levels. As he has the luckiest of eggs. Lord, I was standing guard at the top and some old coot yelled at me. He served me so much that I fell down here. To think I'll be venting my anger by taking it all on you. Okay, sir. <clears throat> Please do be aware that I will be clapping your cheeks in response to you trying to clap mine. Ooh, Typhlosion. What level is he, though? Nine. We're level six, so... Sometimes, in life... You have to risk the biscuit. He leered, thank God. Come on. Eight or nine. Eight or nine. Eight or nine. Six. That's shit. 
It's su it stabs super effective, but I don't think it's gonna kill the Typhlosion. And that was a that was a crit. That was a crit. All right, we're gonna swap out. That was a crit. That was a crit six. Stab super effective crit, and he didn't even do half. Mm 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 mm. That's not good enough, man. That's terrible. <laughs> That's absolute anus. We got to level 8 now. And you got to 16, so that's kind of calm. Excuse you? Alright, we ain't missing around with Dragonite, it's a Sado. I'd rather have all my Pokemon. Also, it stopped looking like me, it looks more like a Dragonite now. I kind of recovered with, with leftovers for doing nothing. The turn order of these things in this game is kind of wild. Alright, isn't it Rap? He can't really do much because he's low level, but he does... He does take a bit to take down, unless we had a nice move. And I know we have a nice type in the PC, but Seal does not learn any moves until it gets to about 30-something, so there's no point. Anyway, we're thrashing around, so this dragon is done. He's cooked, bro. He's cooked. There we go. Good old Tube Sock. Anyway, we defeated the Grunt. Near, near, near. Hello, lady. Stop taking tiles. Yeah, just ready to feed all of us. Okay. By the way, you can get Slowpoke here, but only in the water. It's ironic that you come to Slowpoke while I think, I'm going to get Slowpoke. That'd be cool. Sorry, no, you can't. Smoochum. Um, I'm not risking a Smoochum. If you're wondering why I'm not risking a Smoochum, uh, Smoochum is an ice type and we're weak to ice, so I don't know if it has icy wind or not. I don't think it does. Uh. 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 Also, why does Smoochum look like a duck? It, Jinx does not look like a duck. I never understood it. I never got it. Doesn't make sense. Cubo. Alright. Bop it. This is a level 11 Cubo. Right, he's not evolved. You are evolved. I expect you to clap his cheeks. They should do at least 50% or I'm going to be very upset with you. That done like... 20% max. <laughs> Two seconds static need the levels more than Smokey and Stank. But these Pokemon are not all favouring grass and water type execution. Bone Club! Ow, quit! Just <laughs> like <laughs> whack a mole fucking <laughs> Dr. O's head. Just bang! <laughs> you know what? You're, you're now a pin. You're now a dig duo, bro. You're a bonk, now you're a diglet. <laughs> no, my power! You fool. Oh, Boppy got to nine. Why is Boppy's attack stat? Also, that just looks like Jesse. Um, what is your stats, bro? His attack is 19. Compared to 36, 31, 29, and 31. Oi, 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 kazi, oi, oi, oi. Sunstone? That's nice. That's another rare stone that we can get our hands on. But I think it only gives us a uh, sun kern into a sun floor if we ever find one. Quit thinking, Flobo tells if we don't play two teams, Rocket Rep will be ruined. I know it's 29 minutes, but we are going to beat the boss who's standing at the top there. So there's only two more fights to go. This one and the next one. No, this is Alright, uh, I am not... Again, I am... I am absolutely not risking it. Um, Stank, you can do this. I'm not risking it just because it doesn't make any sense to fight a nice type with the ground type who, for some reason, cannot do any damage to save his life. I mean, we get the 50%, I believe it's 50% buff from the Lucky Egg anyway, so he is gaining good XP. So he's gaining more than Stank does. Tentacruel! 
Finally, after 55 years, an enemy the Static X can take down. I am jubilant. I am so ecstatic. I don't know. Why did I say it? Why did I just... Why did I just shut my mouth? I saw something X. I guess it was my name? So I'm hoping I didn't say he used like... X defend or something. I just saw like, X. I was like, oh no. Alright, uh, yeah, he's going down in one. That's the Thunderbolt from a fucking Riot Shoot bro. Alright, Bop It is now 10. Bro. Bro, what level is this Jigglypuff? How that? That Jigglypuff looks like he's on a mission, bro. Level 9 Jigglypuff. Magnitude 9. Do damage. Thank you. Finally made able to take something out. It's a bloody chili puff. 23 attack. Okay. Author grunt. Ugh. Alright. Boss time. I know we're at 31 minutes, but we're going to kick his ass. What do you want? If you interrupt our work, don't expect any mercy. And that's a strength rock up there, so um, we're supposed to come back later and get some. I believe you get a king's rock in a minute, so you can get um, slow king. Oh. Well. You're weak to grass. Uh, grass resists you. You are weak to grass, and grass resists you. So I uh, guess we're going with Tube Sock. <laughs> this one I want a flying or a fire type. I don't even mind. Give me a, give me a regular roll. Oh, Lord. We're going to risk the biscuit and just go for fresh. I just pray to M or Jesus. Okay, that's not what I wanted. I wanted him to vine with me again, to be honest. Because now he's going to live. Told you. I think it's a vine whip anyway. Oh, critical, bro. What the fuck is wrong with you? What a bitch. Anyway. He only had one Pokemon. I don't even see that he only had one Pokemon. Yeah, okay today, Brad, but uh, wait till next time. Yeah, Team Rocket was broken up three years ago, but we continued our activities on the ground. Now you can have fun watching us drip trouble. I don't even remember what voice I gave Kurt. <laughs> Wait, forgot. Way to go, Gold. Team Rocket has taken off. My back's better too. Let's get out of here. Yay. Hi, Gold. You hand yourself like a real champ in that world. I like your style. I'm going to make balls for your trainer like you. So he just gives us a little ball for free. Yeah, I'm not really going to listen to him too much. You have to give him apricorns, which are on some of these berry bushes. We don't really give a damn about them. Because they are kind of silly. We're going to heal up here. Because why not? And we're going to go to where we're going to go in the next episode. Look at that. The um, Team Rocket gentleman has left the gym. So I'm going to walk in here. And as you can see, there are two nice ladies standing right in front of us. I think we're more than ready to take the gym because I believe this gym is like level 14, I think. And this gym is a complete 180 from the last one in vanilla, where he has a Scyther, a, which is crazily strong. for if, You know, it's a decently powerful Pokemon. It just got a Scyther. And you're just like, uh -huh. Anyway, thank you for watching today's episode of the Pokemon Gold Randomized Test Lock. Hopefully you enjoyed it. Join us in the next episode as we will take on this gym and then progress through Ilex Forest. Um, but for now, goodbye.